Creta policies can be considered as an ordered set of rules that help you standardize and de-escalation process in engine development. With this feature, you can create rules for a review process based on label flags. The focus is on the following question. Should a calibration be merged or not? The following roles are involved in this process. The administrator, the policy owner, the project engineer and the reviewer. The administrator creates policies and impacts. Therefore, switch to the Edit tab and in the Policies group, select Review Policies. On the Policies tab, click Add Policy. Here you can specify the name of the policy and select one or several label flags. Based on the selected flags, the policy rules will be applied in case of policy violations during the import of a calibration, which I will show you later. You can also select impacts from the list. One or more impacts can be assigned for each policy. Optionally, you can also write a description. Click the icon next to the owner field to open the select user window. Select a user who will be allowed to edit the policy. Optionally, you can also select a deputy by selecting the icon next to the appropriate field and assign a user. To add a reviewer to a policy, click Add Reviewer. Select a user who will be responsible for the controlling, accepting, rejecting or putting up a calibration for discussion. Multiple selection is also possible. Click the right arrow to add the selected users as reviewers. If you want to remove a user, Select the appropriate user in the right pane and click the left arrow. You must assign at least one reviewer. Click OK to save your settings. To define additional impacts, switch to the Impacts tab. Here you can add, export or import impacts. To edit one, click the icon next to the appropriate impact. You can add an additional impact value or just edit an existing one by clicking the icon next to the value. Impacts and their values are displayed in the security level window, which opens in case of policy violation during the import of a calibration. After creating policies and impacts, the policy owner can now edit them, assign a reviewer to each policy, and assign review policies to each variant. To edit policies, Switch to the Edit tab in the Policies group and select Review Policies. On the Policies tab, select the policy listed in the table and click the Edit icon. Here you can make the desired changes. To add additional reviewers to a policy, click Add Reviewer. Here you can again assign users to reviewers. Click OK to save it. Click OK again to make your policy settings take effect. Policies will not be activated unless the assignment of review policies is completed. They are assigned for each project on the variant level. To assign review policies, right-click Revisions in the Creta Explorer tree and select Assign Review Policies from the context menu. Here all variants of the Revisions node are displayed. If you just right-click a revision and select Assign Review Policies, only the variants of the selected revision are displayed. In the left grid, you can see the available policies, and in the right grid, they are the assigned policies. Select your desired policy and the appropriate variant you want to assign to the selected policy. You can also select a reviewer in the Reviewer column. Policies which are assigned to a variant can be deactivated by selecting the checkbox of the deactivated column. If a policy should be active only from a certain point of time, you can specify the date in the Active From and Active To columns. Click OK to make your changes take effect. After assigning the review policies, the project engineer can now import calibrations and edit labels. 
When importing a calibration and a policy violation occurs, the project engineer can comment on affected critical labels and provide additional information for the review ticket. In this case, the A0 label with the function security label flag is affected. The affected critical labels table lists all violated policies as well as affected labels. Optionally, you can add a comment to the affected critical label by clicking the small browser button in the comment column. Select if the change has side effects. Further, you can describe the side effects, type the reason for the change and add the security level and a description of the consequences. If there are no side effects, you can also type an X in the appropriate fields. Click OK to save your documentation for the review ticket. In the Document Calibrations window, you can now see in the Is Documented column that your calibration is documented. If you want to edit it, just click on the Browser button and make your changes. Click Start to import your calibration. It is then displayed which label flags the labels or axes of the imported calibration contain. If they are considered as important, they should be double-checked. Now Krita has created the related review ticket. As calibrations with affected critical labels must be reviewed, the previous assigned reviewer, in this case the calibration pilot, now checks the calibration and sets the appropriate status. Therefore, switch to the Edit tab and in the Policies group, select Review Tickets. The Project Review Overview window displays all review tickets grouped by project and created during the import of calibrations. The Review columns display the number of the corresponding tickets. To review the calibrations, select a project and click the Browser button in the Review column to open the Calibration Review window. In the View Mode Review, this window displays all review tickets grouped by calibration file. On creating a review ticket, Krita sets each ticket to pending initially. Set the status of each ticket by selecting the status from the list in the Review Status column. Unlike calibrations, review tickets only have four status. You can accept, reject it or put it up for discussion. Click OK to save your current changes. So with review policies, you can create rules for a review process based on label flags. The different roles take on the corresponding tasks of creating, assigning, documenting and reviewing the review policies and the corresponding tickets in order to help you standardize a de-escalation process in engine development.